was paying. Nigeria, support this protest. We will hit the street until the people is done. The hardship in Nigeria is so, so hard. The hardship is so, so hard. I repeat, it's an embassy. It's so, so hard. That is why NLC all over Nigeria is protesting. The government has created a lot of policies that is causing serious hardship on the masses. That is why we have this protest in Joss. All over Nigeria, NLC is protesting. In some other states, civil society have protested because of the hardship on daily basis. The increase of food prices is so much. The hunger is so much. I got something at 8,000 yesterday. Today I went, it's 11,000. Tomorrow, we don't know what the price is going to look like. That is, that is why everyone is protesting. And this government, I don't know what they are saying about it. And the unfortunate, the unfortunate thing is that the president told us that there is nothing they can do about it. Can you imagine? We are just suffering. The masses are suffering. The country is going down. The inflation is on the increase. Uh, last month, inflation was 29.9%. For God's sake, can you imagine? We are all hungry and the country is hungry. The government should do something about their policies. Dollar is for the increase. Today, dollar is 1,000, almost 900 naira. There is nothing we can do about it. And people are suffering. The prices of this food stuff is going high. Please, the government, we are calling the government to come to the aid of most especially the masses. We don't know what we are going to do. We don't know what they are going to do. But we are uh, praying that they should bring up policies that will help the masses in this country. Thank you very much. And God bless Nigeria. God bless NLC. God bless every citizen of this country. Thank you. Um, uh, comrades. Victor Luca from University of Joss. And we want to plead with this government that the government should do the needful 
people are dying. There is high rates of kidnap. You know, wickedness has increased because we are not living in peace. We are asking Tinubu to do the needful. People are suffering. No food. People are in their need of medicine. We ask this government to do the needful, to pay workers their wages. The workers of Nigeria are not happy. We are not happy of the situation on ground. And that is the reason for this protest. As you can see, we came out in mass to protest over the high rate of cost, uh, high living of things in the market. You know, we are not living well in this country. A common man cannot feed well. A common man is suffering. What will the poor do? Will the poor die? No, we are asking this government to do the needful. If not, things that are going to happen in the nearest future is not going to be good. High cost of living, fuel has gone up. Food prices in the market you cannot touch. So please and please, government of Tinubu, do something, do something, so that we will survive in this country. If not, in the nearest future, things are going to go bad. Thank you so much. We go to the same value. We buy things the same. The salary is not in Toronto. Then we go to market. The entire salary can finish in one product. The bag of rice which was sold at just a small amount of money. Then when you give the entire salary, ten times you cannot afford one bag of rice. You can imagine somebody having more than five children. How can you take care of those children? Well, well that was sold, the person, the food that was sold at maybe let's say 400 or something. Now, even 700, they will deceive you that the 700 Naira money is even above 700. Tell me, how can you cope with such a situation? It's very difficult. The masses are suffering. Everybody is suffering from this country. The space, the space at which government is giving is too slow for our liking. Even if they want to identify some things in order, it's not just working. It's not just working. The system has collapsed. People are suffering. So families can barely afford one spare meal a day. One, not to talk of staying for some days without food. So it's very, very big. The hardship is being inflicted on people. It's just too much. So we can hardly bear this situation. That's why we are protesting to show our displeasure over government's inability to provide on the gather for citizens. That's why we have to show. NLC has taken this bold to solidarity with the entire country. So we expect people to give NLC the support so that we will fight for government to make this. Thank you.